how do we know that we're on safe ice right now? We have a big crack and that's kind of scary, but what are the cracks in the ice for? The lake needs to relieve pressure as the water expands and it cracks, right? That's why we have all this water on the surface. It cracks and the water comes up through the cracks and fills the top of the ice, top of the lake. Now this is what I've been using to measure my ice thickness. This is just a fish measuring board. This ice here on top, you see it's different color. It's like really light, right? It's like a, a honeycomb or, or it's like you can see bubbles in it. That's, if we had eight inches of this color white ice, it would not be safe, okay? But if you look, we find the bottom where that meets the black ice and it's maybe two inches. That's two about there. So we maybe have two or three inches of unsafe ice. Now below it, we have clear ice. I can measure it with this tool. Actually, we're right up to there. So we might have maybe four inches of bad ice in spots. Now it's all clear ice down below, if you can see down below. Now we're gonna stick this to the bottom of the ice. We're gonna hook it to the bottom. So we're 13 inches all together. Let's say it's four inches of bad ice. 13 minus four is? Nine. nine. So we have about nine inches of really good ice. Let's check this hole. Let's see if it's the same. Okay, so we have you can even feel it with this tool. There you go. See that? See that? I'm on top of, I'm actually on top of the ice. So it goes to right here, to this X. So I have about four inches of bad ice. We don't want to go on. I'm going to go down to the bottom. I'm going to feel it. Again, I'm about 13. So I've got nine, eight or nine inches of safe black ice. And we know that this is good for us to be out on and we know it can support the weight of our family. If this was three inches of black ice, clear ice, we don't wanna all be in one spot. We wanna be spread out because that distributes our weight, right? Do you wanna feel it and see where the, the good ice starts? Don't drop our measuring tool down the ice. You want to feel the edge of the of the bad ice. Okay, so how much ice do we have? Four inches of bad ice. Four inches of unsafe ice. Go to the bottom and hook it on. Thirteen. 13. Are you on the bottom? So 13 minus four, nine. We know that we have nine inches of safe ice. Pretty good, eh?